G'day troopers, another beautiful day in paradise, Cairns, that's not a swamp, it's mangroves. Today what I'll be doing is showing you how I deliver mail on my posty bike with one hand without putting my feet down. Before I do that though, I just want to say a few things about these bikes. Honda Cubs, CT110, Good, good machines, but it would be better if they had a central tank so you could grab it with your knees and have better control of the machine at low speeds. Otherwise, you tend to slide around a little bit on your seat. The other thing is the front tyre. It would be nice to have a knobby tyre so you've got better control on wet grass and especially when you find yourself in a situation where you're momentarily stationary and then you turn your handlebars, take off and the front wheel just slides out and you end up putting your feet down, which is not what we want. And the last thing is the gearing. Normally on bikes, if you step all the way down, you end up in first gear. So in the heat of the moment, when you are delivering mail and you end up stepping all the way through, sometimes you end up in neutral and that gives you no power. So you can't take off at will and you end up putting your foot down. So um, these are the three things I would improve on this bike. But uh, apart from that, let me take you for a spin and show you how it's done. Let's go. So the trick is um, to ride at a constant speed in a straight line. I'm aiming for that letterbox. It's number six on this street. Once you approach to it, you can slow down, use your back brake, momentarily stop and take off. The envelopes you want to hold in the middle so they don't flop around in the wind. Yep, got that done. Hang on, I missed number two. See, they were too close together, so I couldn't do two in one go. Let's have a go at number two. All right, so straight line, envelopes in the middle. Nah, that didn't work very well. The parcel's a little bit big. Let's give it a bit of a push. There you go, cool. Number one, it's not gonna work because it's a, a mouse trap door. So some letterboxes just don't wanna play. This one is good. But obviously it's too close. Number five, I'll do a handover. G'day mate. All yours, thank you. Seven, look at this. Straight run up. There it goes. Nine, so that's this one here. Once again, straight run up, slow down. Use your back brake to stop if you have to. Give yourself time, don't pressure yourself. Make sure there's no obstacles. There you go, number 13. Oh no, 11. So sometimes you get more than one item per letterbox, in which case you have to go back. And I seem to have lost my thimble. Whoopsie. Anyway, slow down. Oh, yep, that went in and I didn't drop the bike. So it's there, cool. Get it. Wow. This one should be doable. This one should see the water meter, but my bike should be able to traverse that. Good. This guy could be getting more than that. He's getting one. Hello. Uh, no. We might have to hand it. Oh, even better. Thank you. Well, didn't put my feet down, that counts. <sighs> La. Trap door again. Actually, let's do hand to hand. Thank you. Drive. Thank you. No hands. This one I should do. Lock. This one's doable. I don't want to say anything, but I'm getting a good run here. No junk mail, no junk mail. 
stuck up. Now I know 17 is a little bit high. So let's see how we go with that. So that's going to be a little, ah oh, no. Double, ah, I touched the wall, damn you. I'll see so well. Done. So that's the problem. Every second letterbox has got a flap or a mouse trap like this one. You just can't. Oh no, this one's okay. That was an easy one. Oh, a vertical opening, doable. It's another vertical. Yep, done. Beautiful. Oh, another one. Fuck you. Done, cool. If you have a letterbox that's too high, that's going to get tricky as well because you can't really. Oh no, got it. They're harder to get in because they the really should be weight high, like this one here. This one's got grooves in front of it, so it's, you're doing a number of things. No, see, that didn't go in properly. Let's fix it up. There you go, son. That's how it's done. You've got to have letterboxes that want to play. This one is small, but got it done. All right, what's the next address?